Hey guys, welcome to another episode of my Vlogmas. I'm not even sure if this is day two or day three anymore. Um, but today I am getting my Christmas tree. I have my dad in the back seat and y'all favorite person, my brother. <laughs> they are coming with me to get my tree. Um, so I'm excited. I we don't do real uh, we don't do fake trees. My entire life we've always grown up we had a real tree, so that's what we are headed to go find right now. Um, so yeah. Last year I thought about how things can Yes, I am on my way Christmas tree um, and I'm really excited about it so um, as far as like the tree details I just went to some random like Christmas tree lot that was by my apartment um, so yeah there was like no specific tree that uh, or specific tree place that I usually go to like honestly you just drive around your neighborhood I'm sure there is like if you are interested in a live tree I'm sure there are live tree lots around you um, and the tree that I have I got the I want to say was the Douglas fir um, that's the type of branch and like needle it is. First of all, it smells so good. I love the smell of Christmas trees. Um, that is the only reason why my family every year we always get live trees because we just love the smell. 
Um, and it's just like a different look, a different aesthetic, and just like coziness or whatever. Um, like when I lived with my parents, we would always have a live tree and then we had a wood burning fireplace. So Christmas is to me is my favorite holiday, not because of like getting gifts and all that. I'm like, I'm not really obsessed with like the gifts part. For me, it's just like the way the house looks it's like a coziness that comes with Christmas. Um, so yeah, like I love fireplaces and like real trees and like the stockings and all that stuff. So I'm really excited to decorate. Um, I'm going to decorate this little TV stand area. I imagine, I pretend that my TV stand is like a mantle, so I'm going to be decorating this, um, obviously decorating the tree, and maybe a few other places around my apartment. Maybe some stuff for the kitchen. I have not too sure yet. I have to go home decor shopping for Christmas stuff, but uh, that should be coming soon. So, so going back to the actual details of my tree, um, like I said, I have a Douglas fir. That is the branch style, um, and I want to say it's about four or five feet um i'm not exactly sure. well it's definitely not four feet because i'm five feet and it's a little bit taller than me so it's about a five foot tree um and i think how much i i paid like i think i paid like 60 dollars for it yeah i paid somewhere around like 60 65 dollars for it christmas trees are not cheap especially not the live ones um there and this was like on the low end of the spectrum i got this particular tree because it's short and i didn't want to take up too much space but they had like really tall like grand christmas trees and i was like i don't need all of that um this was the perfect size and it's the perfect width i love how full it is so this was the perfect tree for me my dad actually picked out the tree um so that was cool or whatever <laughs> um my brother it was funny my brother the first tree that i was going to get that i wanted my brother picked it out but we had walked away to look at another tree and then we came back and we were about to tell the guy that that's the tree that we wanted but somebody had already decided to take the tree that my brother recommended so then my dad found this tree and that's the tree that we took home so i will insert a clip to show you guys basically how my family tends to try to keep our trees alive for a long time or like keep them fresh um is to use a little bit of sugar in the water um as you know sugar for a lot of plant processes is the basis for like all of their photo I, I'm not gonna get real sciencey. I just remember that somewhere in photosynthesis, sugar is used to like do some stuff. That's all I'm gonna say about that. But yes, <laughs> we use sugar. Uh, we add some sugar to the water to help the tree last a little bit longer. Um, and so you guys will see a clip um, somewhere in this video. I will show you guys an example of me doing that. And it just added to the base of the tree. I usually add um, the first container of water that I add will have the sugar in it um, and then I'll add a second layer that's just plain water and to, that will be, that should be enough water to like dilute everything and give the tree like a good balance of water and you know sugar water or whatever. Again like I said I'm not a super sciencey person so it is what it is that's just what we do. Um, I also do that for my flowers so like if I go to Trader Joe's or I buy um, flowers from like the grocery store or something like that. Um, I also do use a little bit of sugar to um, make them last a little bit longer um, and it works so I don't question it <laughs> so yeah that basically is it for today's video um, I'm not gonna decorate in this video because I actually have some work that I need to get done um, so this as far as vlogging for today this I got to cut this off um, but I will probably decorate the tree tomorrow. Um, like I said, I do have to go home decor shopping. So at some point I will be decorating like the little TV stand. I, I act as if the TV stand is like my little mantle or whatever. So I will be decorating this too. Um, and maybe a few other places around my apartment. So um, make sure you guys tune in for the next episode of my Vlogmas series. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye guys. Yes, every time the snow is falling down. And it is cold outside We gather around the fireplace And no one cares about yesterday